All right, this is uh, Elite Code 876, middle of the linked list in JavaScript. Um, you're supposed to return the middle node of the linked list. So here's the linked list. You're supposed to return this. Uh, and if there's two middle nodes, return the second one. So, for example, here, there are two, so return this one. Uh, the solution for this talks about the super cool, fancy way to do it in O of N and a fast and slow pointer that essentially uh, that I've seen, you have a slow pointer that goes half as fast as the fast pointer. And then when you get, when the fast pointer gets to the end and the slow pointer is half as fast, then you just return that slow pointer. That's not how I did it. Uh, I came up with a different way to do this. So I will, uh, I'll walk through it. So essentially what I did is I, Let's grab this right here. I made a count and I counted <clears throat> all the way to the end of this and then I divided that in half and then I incremented again until count was uh, zero. Or yeah, until until I reached the, the halfway point there. So I'll walk through how I did it. So count is zero. Just to initialize that. And then uh, I made a dummy head. <clears throat> so I made a dummy head in here. So we can console. Actually, let's do this first. And then I made a I made a head one and head two that we'll use to walk through and find the middle point and then to return. So if I just do head one here, you can see run code. So all I did is I just added a zero in front of this and okay. Uh, so we don't need that. Let's get that out of there. Okay. Um, so now I'm going to loop through uh, this head one that I created to find the length of it. And we're going to do that by just incrementing the count and then walking through walking through the node. So every time we go through, we just increment the count and then we walk through and then we increment the count and then we walk through. And when we get to the end here, uh, this node won't have a pointer to next. It will be null. And then we will have a nice count at the end of that. So we can console log count. Let's uh, run that there. Okay, so our count is five. So now that we have our count, um, 
what I did is I we're gonna do the edge case bit first here. So if counts if the count's even, so like the count is six, we're gonna increment count. And the reason for that is this right now, count divided by two would be 2.5, so we'd end up here. Um, but if this, if there was a six here, we need to end up here. And maybe that'll make more sense here in a second. So while i is less than count divided by two, so what I'm doing here is I'm just taking my count and having it, and that would be the middle of the middle of the list. Um, we're going to take head two and uh, walk through head two, and we need to inc we need to increment i, and we also need to actually declare i. Okay, and then from there, let's return head two. So if we run this, that's working. And if we submit this, let's double check, make sure this works. I typed it out correctly. Cool, great, it works. So let's go back to this here. Um, yeah, if I don't increment, if this doesn't get incremented, then this won't work. It will return three, four, five, six instead of four, five, six. So that's that. And then the other thing that we can do here is, uh, let's console log count divided by two, just to show you that. So we're at 3.5. So while i is less than 3.5, walk through here, i is less than 3.5, i is less than 3.5, uh, i is less than 3.5, and then, you know, head is walking through these, and then head is, head two, sorry, uh, is equal to 4, 5, 6, and at that point we just return it. down here and the other thing we can do let's console out head two as well so you can see it walking through right so our input one two three four five six and as we're walking through this Right, we're walking through zero, hit one, two, three, and then at that point, um, we hit four and we return it. So that's how I did that one. Uh, I know there's other ways to do this. This is just the way that I was able to come up with it. Anyway, you should subscribe. And I'll see you next time.